Is it a cursed island? Is the treasure cursed? Am I gonna turn into a skeleton at night? Oh god! Or am I just gonna get attacked by crocodiles? Hello, 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 and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. In the last part, we finished up all the quests in Saqqara Nome and made our way to Fayum, the place where the crocodile lives, who is our next target, who we need to murder or assassinate, whatever word you want to use. But today we're going to be exploring Fayum and all the delicious treasures it has to offer. And uh, I guess we're going to start with the very first place, right where we're standing, some weird... Uh, you know, dilapidated temple thing that people are using as a marketplace for some reason. Oh boy, somewhere where I have to pull my torch at. I see you, Mr. Snake! I'm gonna throw this torch at you! Ha ha! Oh, it didn't seem to bother you that much. Hang on, let me throw another one at you. Here we go. That one doesn't seem to bother you either. There we go. Did that kill you? Are you dead? Yeah, you're dead. Alright. Sweet. Loot him. And take your torch back. Cool. There's a dead guy here who's actually floating and not on the ground, but never mind. Just gonna ignore that. And here's our treasure. Aren't we lucky? Open it. What crap thing is it? Ooh, a crap axe that I don't need or want. My favorite. I've also decided to switch to the black camel that I got with the season pass um, because it's super sweet and his name is Apop and he's got like tusks hanging from his ears and I think that's just amazing. Okay, got a guard camp, what a surprise, but... Uh, they will attack on sight here. They will attack on sight here, but... Oh, this sweet little... Yeah, now assassinate him. That was really nice of them to put that in there. Those trees to grow like that for me. Oh no! I thought these were guys, but apparently they're crocodiligators. Dead. And just gonna kill you really quick. No problem, no problem. And you're dead. Ooh, I found a stone circle! Super! It took me a second to figure out what the hell it was talking about. Yes, I haven't done one of these in forever. I almost forgot he had a dead kid. Not. Uh, that was a long one, huh? Papa? Why do people die? Because you touch we yourself at gods. night. Everything must die. It is what a moon has ordained for us. Will we be together in the afterlife? Be brave and strong. Fight for justice. Do not lie. This is all anyone can do. Ma'at will decide if we are worthy to walk together in a field of reeds. I'm sure you will, though. Your car is good. I found it. That took forever. I'm usually I'm really good at these. <laughs> there we go. They do fish. Ew, you're laying in a swamp, Bayek. That's that's grody. Okay, our first viewpoint of the area, and it's on top of this uh temple thing, or a Serapion, which I'm not really sure what that is. But it's gonna be on top of this guy's head, who is um uh Poseidon, I believe. No, it's not Poseidon, it's somebody else. I looked it up before and now I can't remember. But it's somebody, and it's not Poseidon. I'm wrong about that. Or Hades, because it's... got cer Cerebrus with him, which is weird. Alright, can I... There's nowhere for me to jump down here, so I'm not gonna do that. Seems like a silly thing to do. Oh, but there's a zipline! Zipline! Whee! Oh, my hands! I'll never use them again! Oh, and we have a papyrus scroll, the leading tower in Fayum, that's where I am, north of Dionysius Caravanella. There is a tower with a hole by its feet. It's in need of support, so I sit behind it, but the wooden beams seem more helpful. Okay, I'll try and remember that. Ooh, underground stash. Sounds like a fun place to go. Let's go. I must be careful now. No, you don't. Just kill all these guys. Super annoying. Die. Super annoying and they're like way lower level than you. Just beat him up with your axe. Hey, you! No, you stop. Stop your boat so I can catch it. The area's off limits. They already saw you. Hi. Die. I've come to take your boat and your women. Well, there's no women here, so I'll take you. Ah! Oh, you're a big one, huh? Ow! You're huge! Run away, Bayek! Kill this one. This one's little. 
So it's little like you. Ah! The big one! Got him! Nice! And he gave me a crap sword for all my effort. Ooh, a throne! Oh, I wish I could sit on it. That'd be so awesome. Are there caged animals on your boat that I can free and then kill? Hi. Take an axe in the face. I think he just called me a gay slur, but I'm not sure. Die. Die for your homophobia. And here I am, at last, in the Fayum. I will root out the agents of the crocodile. Oops. Actually, no, I just want the viewpoint, if that's all right with you. Don't actually want to um, take on the main mission right now, but thank you for offering. I'm just going to grab this viewpoint and get the hell up out of here, if that's okay with you. Ooh, has Ian got a cool name, the Vault of Splendors. No, I want you to just go up. Thanks. All right, now we're going to stand on another naked dude's head. Yep. And get this viewpoint. It's super pretty. Very Greek looking. It's a weird contrast between what's obviously Egyptian, what's obviously Greek. That's cool, I like it. I just realized also on Apop's body there are skulls. He's carrying skulls. He is a badass and don't mess with him. Ooh, Golden Horn Island. Cool. What's here? Just treasure? Really? Okay. Dead guys. Is it a cursed island? Is the treasure cursed? Am I gonna turn into a skeleton at night? Oh god! Or am I just gonna get attacked by crocodiles? Or hippos! That wasn't a crocodile, it was a hippo. Die, hippo! You're a big girl, huh? My goodness, die! Oh holy crap, I even found another stone circle! That's two in one area! That's... A first, I think. Don't remember there ever being two. And I sucked at the last one. Let's hope I do better on this one. Don't mind that I almost knocked my water bottle over. Papa, do you think I'll have many children? <laughs> hey, I hope you give your mother and I many grandchildren. Oh, sorry, I didn't get to finish it. And you won't, because you die. Who's that? Tower rat. Is that a hippo? I think it's a hippo. I can't really tell. I wouldn't see five lot five dots and say, that's a hippo. <laughs> Bayek, stop splaying. Disgusting. Okay, here's our next synchronization point, which seems like it's kind of in a weird place. It's kind of just some random, not super fancy looking house. I mean, it's fancy looking, but it looks kind of run down stuff on top of this hill surrounded by crappier looking houses. So I don't know. It's just a, for me, it's a weird place to have a synchronization point, And it's yeah, and it's, I'd rank it in the lower end of the ones we've seen so far. It just shows us desert and mountains, which are nice, but there's like way better ones. Ooh, and it looks like we have a Falaki tech we can kill. Roz Mercy. Mmm. Mmm, boy. Level 30, I'm level 32. We're gonna take you on, baby, as soon as we go over here and see what the hell this is. Ooh, it's a hyena lair. Hi, fellas. Doesn't really look like your lair. It looks like you sort of killed everyone who was here and then just took over. Oh yeah, good good job. Miss. Miss, miss. Let them eat you, Bayek. This is the biggest- look at this! This is the biggest hyena lair I've ever seen! Look how many there are! Holy... Frijoles. Which means holy beans. Hey, fellas! Looking for some action? Whee! I'm gonna take out the leader from here. Eh. No, gotta aim at him, Bayek. There you go. Set him on fire a little bit. Watch him burn. Sweet. But I need to get down there anyway, because I want to kill all those hyenas for their for their pelts, because it helps me upgrade my equipment. Alright, Mr. Man, we're coming for you. Oh, he seems to be riding something. Let's see, he's got a chariot like the last guy, or is he just on a horse? Hope a chariot. Chariots are so fun. Yes, I know, I'm following him. That one. No, God. This bow. Come on. I catch up to him a little bit. No, I said catch up to him. Don't slow down. I know you're scared, but there's no need to be. I'm here. Hey, oh, damn it. There we go. Ah, Nisame. Medjai! I had the wrong weapon out, Medjai. Oh, God. Get off, get off, get off, get off. Use, use your special ability. There you go. 
Yeah, really take him down. Really take him down a peg. And I killed him. That was really easy. Dead. Nearby untracked quest, assassinate the Falakis. No, I'm good with just killing this one at the moment. Yes. Ooh. And he gave me dual swords that are crappier than mine. Ah, oh, Dionysia Sicara Venesari. This is the place where um, that papyrus scroll is. So, let me just read that real quick one more time. So, because I've forgotten already. Uh, the Leaning Tower. North of this place, there is a tower with a hole by its feet. All right. So I'm going to take care of this place. This yeah, yeah, whatever. And then see if I can find that tower. Oh, crap! There's a dude here who's going to kill me dead. Get up, Bayek. He's got a red skull and everything. Run away! I can't because he's blocking the doorway. Run away, Bayek. Why is there a red skull guy here? That doesn't seem fair. Is this supposed to be an area for, like... Oh, great. The Falaki tie wasn't even this difficult. He was only, like, level 30. Run away! Run away! Oh, look at that! Look at how high level they are! This is poop! Hang on a minute. Hang on a mo. This place is between levels 24 and 29, and that place has a huge uptick in that, so that is... That is just false advertising, sir. Okay, well, forget that place. Forget the papyrus scroll. You guys can screw off. I'll come back when I'm, apparently, when I'm level, like, 40 or whatever. Oh, this is so awesome. Just want to point out that, I know, I'm sorry, that people are flying kites. There's a lot of them. They're all over the place. People are flying kites. That's so cool. I love it. I haven't flown a kite since I was a really little kid. I haven't gotten to destroy one of these statues in forever. Destroy it. Destroy it, Bayek. Don't be shy. Get his legs. Yeah, you set yourself on fire, Bayek! What the hell? How'd you do that? Didn't seem to bother you, though. Find a place to rest. Alright, that's an interesting objective. Don't know how many of those I've seen before, but I feel like I've seen it at least once before. Why would I find a place to rest? Here. Yep. Can I rest here? How do I interact with it? Just sit on it? Sit on it. <laughs> I just had to stand on it and click triangle six times and then he sat down. Bizarre. What a bizarre thing. What on earth is that for? Gave me an ability point though, so that's pretty sweet. Oh, there's a papyrus here. You don't mind if I take this, do you? <laughs> There is a place of remembrance for the unfortunate masses in Northwest Taurus Nome. While I rest here, immobile, I cannot escape Ross Grace, but at least every dawn I avoid him longer than the others. Okie dokie. I have never been there, so don't know what any of that means, but I assume it has something to do with the sun. No, I'm not doing any crests right now, thank you. Stop offering. Okay, and per usual, I'm going to end this part with the final synchronization point of the area, which I can already tell is going to be much better than the last few that we saw. And it's gorgeous. You see the burning tower over there, whatever that is. Some fog. The Nile, some rocks, all gorgeous. Love it, love it, love it, love it. And of course, it also makes my bird senu stronger so that I can see more junk hanging around, which gives me more Myrny, which gives me more stuff, which makes me a happy girl. But I am going to end this part here. We have officially explored every part of Fayum, and in the next part, we are going to take care of all the side quests here in Fayum before we take on the crocodile, him or herself. If you did enjoy, please let me know in the comments. Leave me a like or a dislike if you didn't like it. That's what the button is there for. And of course, you can subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you in the next part of Assassin's Creed Origins. Bye-bye!